All right, hell you guys. Um, we're about to do another reaction video. Uh, this one's gonna be for Wu Chang Fallen Feathers. Uh, now the biggest thing is, I believe this is gonna be kind of like a Souls isk like game. Uh, maybe even whenever it comes to being fast paced combat wise, of maybe something similar to like Black Myth Wu Kong. Uh, if you guys got any information about that at all, please leave it down below in the uh, comments. I would really like to know more about this game in particular because uh, we've only ever seen a little bit of it i think the last xbox showcase that they were doing uh so this is going to be something hopefully new uh this was actually showcased at the partner preview yesterday so either way i'm i'm very excited to go ahead and get into it and why don't we just go ahead and watch it and see what it's all about all right let's do it got people hanging already the main dynasty yeah, I think it is Chinese mythology. Lian Z. So is that the company working on this game? Okay. Sorry, I want to make sure I had it all the way up. Okay. It's got a creepy vibe and I'm loving it so far. Alright, alright. Our lady. She actually looking pretty good too. In game footage work in progress. Alright, alright. Fast combat indeed. Got some dual wields. Alright, that's pretty cool. Got a deflect mechanic. Can't go wrong with a deflect. Ayo. Pretty good looking. Very tight combat thus far. Ooh, that bloodshed was good. God, this looks so beautiful, man. Oh, wow. What the hell? It just got twisted. <laughs> so we're going to get uh, Yogwai. I believe that's like what the term is. Like whenever it comes to like monsters or spirits within there. Because that's what it's looking. We got some undead soldiers here. Or villagers more so. It's like soldiers slash villagers. What is that? Bro, that feather look cool. Bro, what is the enemy? Yo, big bitties. Yo, let's go. She transforms into like a fox and she's got like the fur coat on her. Holy shit. Oh god, is it like a spider centipede? Oh, I hate those. Bro, that gigantic staff vibe. Yeah, some Wukong is. Holy shit. Look at this. <laughs> what the hell is that box about? Yo, this looks good. Probably gonna piss us off whenever it comes to some of these bosses, but damn if it don't look awesome. I wanna know more. My Emperor will not fall in vain. You are just another lost soul. Trying to oppose fate. I'm gonna go ahead and fight you. It's mine. It does seem like we got a lot of different styles to, to play with. Nothing is forever. Wu Chang, Fallen Feathers, coming to 2025 to Game Pass, Xbox Series X, and PC. Alright, I gotta be 100%. That shit looks amazing. Um, like I said, whenever it comes to... First things first, overall, this looks good. This looks absolutely good. Um, I'm excited for it. Now, I do want to mention specifically when it comes to Ru Chang. I don't know much or, much about the Chinese mythology itself, but it seems like it's something about the Fallen Dynasties. At least that's what they were kind of explaining at the start of this. Um, we get to play as that lady. It looks like there's going to be definitely uh, types of like Chinese mythology monsters. I think like the Yogwai uh, that's going to be a part of it, which is actually going to be cool as hell to, to interact and see. Um, combat wise looks very fast and fluent and it definitely has a lot of different mixtures of maybe uh, it, it deflections of like something of Sekiro Shadows like twice uh, they do got some vibes of a little bit of Black Myth Wukong within it as well and also I've been seeing like I think I've saw some pretty decent dodges within there as well so overall it seems like it's going for the action packedness it, it looks really good um, it looks like it's going to be having really tight combat itself I, I like the variation of weapons and, and the diversity of like um 
the 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 choices that you could specifically do with the with um it looks like abilities so that's gonna be cool like weapons and abilities that you're gonna be able to use like you got staffs with flamethrowers on it you got dual wield blades you got your regular like just swords um there's so many different types of things that's going on a lot of magic going on too uh sorry we're kind of looking back at it just to see it um it looks really well crafted now probably the only caveat about this game we got big biddies by the way as well you can tell, tell this ain't no western fucking game like jesus christ thank god <laughs> oh man um but on a serious note uh i do want to mention real quickly uh this game looks really fun probably the only caveat that people are going to have an issue with it with with this game is it's only going to be on xbox and pc compared to it being on playstation 5 uh but i hope people don't judge it too hard for that there shouldn't be any reason as long as it comes out really polished and fun i think that's all we can really ask for and so far everything looks like it's gonna be fun i will say there's not a lot of information about this, but um, I would be willing to definitely play this at the when, when it comes out. I don't know if it's going to be on Game Pass, but if it's on Game Pass, that's going to be all 100%. Yeah, we're doing it. And even if it's not on Game Pass, if it's something that you guys would be interested to see on the channel, maybe we could give it a shot and see what we got. I love Souls games, and look, I'm always up for something really difficult and bitching and raging at. Yeah, it's coming to Game Pass. That's probably a big, a big thing. It's going to be coming to Game Pass. So, yeah, I'm going to be honest. Look, more than likely, I'm going to end up playing this game on the channel. Um, so, it looks like it's going to be really fun, especially if it's going to be coming to Game Pass. Fuck yeah. Um, but seriously, it looks great. I would like to know what you guys fully think about this game. It looks like it's going to be jam-packed and fun. I'm really liking the the mythology sense of what's going on. Um, the, the I guess, mythology and culture that's going for. I like the scenic uh, views and things that we get. It's a very beautiful-looking game. So, artistically, it looks very great. Um, whenever it comes to combat, it seems like it's going to be very fluent and taking a couple things from different game genres. Or not even game genres. Games in themselves that, are, that is in this subgenre of Souls-like isk action oriented games um so like stuff from Sekiro, stuff of black myth wukong that you can kind of kind of you know get a grasp of like oh this kind of looks or feels similar towards so everything's all looking jam-packed like to to be a great time so yeah um i'm very excited we don't have a release date as of right this minute but specifically just talking about it in general looks like it's gonna be an amazing time um so that's really about it. If you did enjoy this, please don't forget to leave it a like and also subscribe to the channel. We're very close to hitting 2,800 subscribers. Plus, if you're looking forward to something like this, just know throughout the time, we've done Black Myth Wukong. We've done Elden Ring DLC. We've done um, Liza P. We've done Neo 2 back then. We've done a lot of Souls games throughout the years. So if you're interested in Souls games, please like it and subscribe to the channel and leave a comment down below about this game in particular and just different things that you may like about souls games or action oriented games i would love to know what you guys honestly like about it as well and get a conversation started specifically about just this it, it's a great time to be a action oriented souls like kind of player because we're just getting left and right something coming out for it so it's a great time Will we probably get bullshitted with some of the mechanics in it? More than likely, but at the same time, to be fair, it still looks amazing and fun to be able to check out and do. So, um, yeah, that's pretty much it, all right? Either way, um, if you like the video, like, subscribe, share. Don't forget to keep it bacon, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace out, you guys.